Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. Sure. Understanding the distinction between Java Threads and Operating System OS, Threads is an essential aspect of concurrent programming. Let's delve into the details of both. Hashtag 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 Java Threads vs OS Threads 1. Java Threads Asterisk Asterisk Java Threads are a part of the Java programming language. They are instances of the java.lang.thread class or implement the runnable interface. Java Threads are managed by the Java Virtual Machine, JVM. This means that the JVM abstracts the underlying OS thread management. Java threads are generally lightweight and are scheduled by the JVM. They are platform independent, meaning the same Java code can run on any operating system with a compatible JVM. 2. OS threads asterisk asterisk. OS threads, or kernel threads, are managed by the operating system. Each OS thread can be scheduled independently by the OS kernel, which allows for true parallel execution on multi-core processors. The OS manages the threads, including creating, scheduling, and terminating them. OS threads are generally heavier than Java threads since they require more overhead for management and context switching. Hashtag 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 key differences. Feature Java threads OS threads. Dash 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 dash. Management managed by JVM managed by the OS. Abstraction high level, Java API, low level, kernel API. Portability platform independent platform dependent. Resource overhead lightweight heavier due to kernel interactions. Context switching JVM manages thread switching OS handles thread context switching. Hashtag 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 code example. Let's see a simple Java example demonstrating the use of threads in Java. This example will create two threads that perform tasks concurrently. Hashtag 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 explanation of the code. One my runnable class, this class implements the runnable interface. It overrides the run method, which contains the code that is executed when the thread starts. In this case, it prints the thread's name and its current iteration five times. Two thread creation, in the main method, two thread objects are created, each associated with an instance of my runnable. Three starting threads, the start method is called on each thread, which invokes the run method defined in their respective my runnable instances. Four joining threads, the join method is called on both threads to ensure that the main thread waits for their completion before proceeding. Hashtag 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 conclusion. In summary, Java threads act as a layer of abstraction over OS threads, providing platform independence and easier management within the Java ecosystem. Understanding the interplay between these two types of threads is crucial for effectively utilizing concurrent programming in Java. If you have any further questions or need clarification on specific points, feel free to ask.